today's the day, finally. A lot of you guys ask me about my gear, what kind of camera equipment I use, what kind of accessories I use when I vlog, and so that's what we're gonna talk about today. Okay, so before I get into the actual gear that I use, I wanna talk to you guys about two things. Two important things when I am looking for gear. I look for quality, quality is always really important, and convenience. Okay, when I say convenience, I think convenience beats quality by a little bit, but convenience. And for example, if I'm looking to purchase a new camera, I am not gonna carry a heavy camera. I cannot, I carry so much already, a very heavy camera that's not practical. So convenience is really important. Practicality, super important. And I definitely think they probably outweigh quality by a little bit. All right, so let's get into it. Let me show you guys my gear. In a perfect world, I wish I could tell you that I only use one camera, but unfortunately I don't. <laughs> okay, so I am a Sony girl. So this is my Sony Alpha 6300. This is a mic that is removable. Um, I've used this camera to vlog before. Um, it's a great camera, I do love it. The quality of the camera is wonderful. The sound does work really well, but the actual convenience and practicality of the camera is not there because for vlogging, ready? Ta-da! That's as high as it goes. It does this, but I can't actually see myself when I'm vlogging. So when I hold the camera like that, it's not really practical. But I have used it to vlog before. If I know I'm going to be in a busy street corner or vlogging at a restaurant, like this is definitely the camera. I add on this mic and it helps so much. The quality from this camera is amazing. And the fact that it isn't heavy is really nice. So I take a lot of photography on this camera and I switch lenses. I have a zoom lens that I switch it with. This lens is, I'm in love with this lens. I love this lens. And my photography and my vlogging Drum roll, please. I love this. This is DJI Mavic Pro. <laughs> I love this thing. This thing is great. This is practical. This does this, which I absolutely love. It takes two seconds to fold and to prepare to fly and to prepare to put away, which is awesome. The professional three, you had to like add on the wings and it just wasn't practical. And it was kind of heavier too. This is super light. and. The remote control is this little thing. Isn't that awesome? Oh. So I love these. I use these for actual aerial shots and for my, obviously, drone video shots. But these two tools are amazing. They're super small, very compactable. Ta-da! The other camera I use to vlog is with this camera because it's perfect. It's a point-and-shoot Sony RX100 and it has the little flip so that I can actually see myself. You see, isn't that beautiful? And, it, and it's super tiny and compactable and this thing goes in my purse. Um, and it's kind of for those quick shots that I need to take and I use them for photography and I use them for vlogging. The reason why I like this camera is one, the audio is actually really good. The quality is awesome, shoots in 4K. And three, it is convenient. The fact that it fits in my purse and I can just pull it out and I can see myself is amazing. My adventure shots. Okay, so I am a big GoPro fan. I love, love GoPro. Why do I love GoPro? Because one, the quality is good. Two, it's very convenient. <laughs> very, very convenient. If you're a clumsy person like me, the fact that you can drop these things and they still function and you can drop them in water and they still function is wonderful. This is the old version of the GoPro and I have shot some of my stuff with it, but not my recent stuff. This is my GoPro 5. Um, I use this for all my adventure shots. So all the cliff diving, all the zip lining, all the fishing, the water stuff, anything like that, I use this baby. This is amazing and I bought tools for this. Um, so the new 5, and they just came out with a 6, which I do have to purchase because I heard the quality is amazing. This, is, this shoots in 4K, which is pretty cool. The 5 is actually waterproof. So I can stick this underwater and I can take those shots that I like and I don't need any other like stuff. And a really cool tip that I learned, if you lick the screen of the camera when you're under the water, so you're under the water and sometimes you get those like water droplets, if you lick the screen of the camera, it removes those water droplets so you don't see them in the film. <laughs> it's kind of gross, but it works! And favorite tools that I bought for the GoPro, my Karma! <laughs> This is, people, this is a Karma GoPro, okay? And this is a stabilizer. Can you see that? Ah, beauty. 
Karma stabilizer. So you don't get that shaky footage um, that no one wants to see. And so again, I use that for a lot of my adventure shots, a lot of hikes and stuff like that. There you have it, that's my gear. That's everything I use. Now, keep in mind, I am not a photographer. I did not go to school for photography. I have everything I have, I have learned from Google, from YouTube, and just experience. Just gone out there, started taking pictures. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, comment below. The description below will have all the links to all of my stuff, so you can go ahead and purchase if you're interested. If you want me to go in depth to a specific type of camera that I'm using, or type of tool, or whatever, let me know. I'm more than happy to create a video for that. If you guys love what you see, don't forget to subscribe for some more love. Thanks for watching, guys. Have an awesome day, and don't forget to love what you do.